morning everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video I thought I would give you a tour of my flat slash apartment some people call it flat some people call it an apartment well it, this wasn't the original video I wanted to put out today but I saw a few comments in my previous video and were well, asking for an apartment tour so I thought I would do one since the house is so tiny and clean I did a spring clean not long ago so this place is so tiny so I thought I'll show you around. Before we start, let me just put up, put it out there that it's not all done. We've been living here for about seven months now. I have tried to do most of the things decoration wise. I would say that it's about 95% uh, done. So if you see me missing anything, I know I, I, I have an eye for all of them. But you can give me a comment telling me what, where I can get something that not expensive but let me just show you what i have here and i hope you are inspired if i will also leave a link where i got all of the things from most of them i got online some are from ebay some are from amazon majority of them are online but a few of them are from the shops i think i shop uh, sometimes at tesco at Coco, and tk max tk max and at homestead so the few that i am not able to find i will probably leave a, a link to a similar product that you may like and yeah i hope you enjoy come on let's go see see what i have here right so when you're coming through the front door this is what you see actually this is what you see this is the side you see a whole big jar of chocolate and marshmallows um this was from bell's party that we never got to use so brought it here for people to pick when they want there is a, a spoon in there so and the thing is no one actually comes here so it's just bell and i eating from it they buy it but then, and then to your right you see this console table that i got from ikea this is also a shoe rack which which is perfect for space saving in every household now be sure to find a hand sanitizer some sort of hand sanitizer gloves and face masks so we have ours here i got this really really nice um tray from amazon we keep our sunglasses a few perfumes tiny perfume miniature perfumes and my car keys and the house key in there then this a diffuser i got from it is, it is by far my favorite ever i am actually running out and i'm freaking out that i won't be able to get some now that the shops aren't closed so yeah i got that from next and then this mirror was from my previous house <laughs> i got that from argos I'm thinking to get a runner to go here because it's a really long hallway and so a little runner will be nice and I, I know you remember this plant that I got from Lidl and this pot also from Lidl I think I'll just show you how the hallway looks like first then I'll take you to the bedroom so this is you going into the living room but right off the hallway I have a, a, a bay window which I've turned into a little library. But sometimes we just, I just come for the books. Bill has her books here, some of her books here. So she comes for it and goes to read. And yeah, I'm thinking to get a bench for me to sit here sometimes if I if I wanted to chill out a little bit because we don't have a, a big garden. Bell's um, slide is here in the hallway. We're, I'm making use of all the space we have. I brought her store here as well so she can get away sometimes if she wanted some time to herself to play. Visitors come over with kids, they also come here to play. I intentionally put this lamp here because look, in this long hallway I have five of these lights, no six of them and imagine having this on the whole night, that would be too much. So I brought this lamp here to light up the, light up the hallway. I got this light from eBay, this lamp. And in here, some artificial plants that I got from Home Bargain, I believe. Under there, Belle has her shopping basket. In this room, there is the laundry. There's the laundry and it's very messy so messy I haven't been able to clear it all out so <laughs> yeah I'm not gonna open it I'm just not gonna do that to myself so yeah the first bedroom you see when you enter the flat is my bedroom let me show you how it looks like 
right so when you enter this is what this is the view you see plus my desk i've moved my desk to the side because it, i think it, i get some quiet time to work when bell is sleeping and I, I i don't get any distractions when i'm here this goes this chair i've never seen it anywhere i saw it at tk mass and i grabbed it people have been asking me about this chest so many times i got one from ebay the other from amazon i think the white one was from ebay and the gray one from amazon and the reason i got these chests instead of a traditional bedside drawers is just so having in mind space saving so in these chests i have bed sheets pillowcases and other things that i save in there and also it, it looks so cool it looks different it looks unusual and this bed i have had since 2014 so it's still and it's still holding up I've changed the mattress and the bed topper, the mattress topper, but the bed frame I got from eBay. These blankets, I have two of them. I got these from HomeSense, these sheets from Amazon. I'm going to put a link to all of them in the description box, so don't worry. These fluffy pillows from Wilco and this painting, I thought it was so cool because it matches with these frames that I got a while ago, they were in my previous house. It's called Serene Waters. And so I thought, yeah, this would be the best one to match, to match this. And of course it has the blush uh, pink color that matches with the, um, the bedding. So yeah, why not? Uh, in the bedroom also, I have this vase, empty vase. I'm, I'm thinking to put some artificial flowers in there. So these are actually shoe racks. I got them from Ikea. And in these boxes, there's space to store shoes. So I still have some shoes in there. I have well, displayed a few of them on top. This is not exactly a walk-in closet, but for a two-bed flat, this is actually very spacious. I got the, the chest of drawers from Ikea. And right here, I have my dressing table from also from ikea and the mirror is from ikea also the lighting i i got from ebay and i put them on there myself this tray i've already shown you a silver one i got that from amazon and these brush holders the uh this cosmetic holder i got from ebay and i have the laundry basket here it was meant to be a wardrobe kind of thing but then i i just put one together to use as a, a laundry basket and in here you have the master bathroom here it's a double shower with uh, I, I know you've seen the Sarah times because I'm always cleaning right and um, <laughs> in here I have a humidifier that I it looks so lovely I bought it but unfortunately it's not one of my best buys from Amazon and um, it's stuck and so I cannot open it which is a bummer um, I have my tincture glass mirror and steel cleaner because I have this humongous <laughs> mirror here and I need to be cleaning it every time so yeah I had to bring this the small one here this was a set with the other one that holds my sponges for my makeup sponges so I brought one here to put my bath salt in <coughs> I got this lovely little basket from Primark. Where I got the, these pictures, these frames from, the shop is closed. It was a shop in Northampton. I can't even remember the name. And so because that humidifier wasn't working, I went to get myself this humidifier. Um, it is lovely. It's working perfectly so far. Because I don't want clutter, too much clutter, I thought I'll buy these cute little cube crystal lamps and it works perfectly uh, i got them from ebay this lovely lovely decks i got this decks from ebay at the end of the hallway you get to bell's bedroom it, it, it appears this is becoming an amazon <laughs> video because most of the things i re i actually got from amazon including this bed this bed and this canopy thing i got from amazon that frame there is framing one of Belle's vest when she was a baby 
she was so tiny under 2 kg even this vest was bigger than her so I thought I'll frame one of them but the frame I got from Ikea this big teddy bear a watch from Costco that panda was from Ikea the spice rack is from Ikea I painted it and that is the other humidifier this chair I got from eBay and the carpet is from eBay as well this wardrobe set this wardrobe with the chest of drawers I got from Ikea and it's very spacious I love this wardrobe for her because it's just the right height she's able to reach everything she wants to wear and that's a good thing these this, it matches with that she has her pyjamas and other clothes there and I, I love that it's all so compact and cute I got this uh, coat hanger from eBay so lovely and I, I got these uh, boxes from Tesco which has her winter clothes the one she doesn't need just opposite her bedroom there's her bathroom well this bathroom also um, is used for visitors when they come here so uh, but it's mainly Belle considering you don't have so many people visiting it's just everything here is Belle and I try to make it neutral not too pink or, or anything because obviously visitors also come here so I, I use grey instead of pink and white towels as a matter of fact I got this on eBay no on Amazon and this clock also I think I got this clock from it could be TK Maxx or HomeSense or something like that I got that clock to match with the theme that's grey and these soap dispenser and brush thing set I got from Wilco and that's the other humidifier that is stuck they're so cute but unfortunately we used it for a while just about a month and it's not working these tiny little so that's Belle's feet by the way these tiny little um, pedal beans uh, bins I got from Wilco as well I think I did a big shop shopping trip and I got that, those from Wilco so moving on this uh, toy caddy munchkin toy caddy I got from Amazon and her penguin bubble blower thing I got that from Tesco she doesn't really use the that soap over there because her skin is so sensitive so we are still on this baby soap yeah that's good for her bathroom really it's quite spacious with a big mirror so as you can see I have been filming for a while now it's evening already yeah this so right off Belle's bedroom you enter the living room I'm sure you have seen this so many times so uh, it's an open plan kitchen and living area I try to keep it as tidy as I can and it hasn't been easy it hasn't been easy to keep up with everything but yeah so I'm gonna start off with these lovely lovely rusty blush chairs and I found these on eBay this chair this is a force this from Argos so for 499 it came with these cushions that I've switched over I got this rug from eBay yeah it looks perfect and because it, it has a marble and gold feel to it I got the go, go, this particular one because I wanted something to match the the legs of these chairs so because of the marble effect and all that I went to find this table I had already bought this this uh, table basket kind of thing from Ikea but it was the wrong color I should have picked white this shelf thing was for Belle it was in Belle's bedroom before but I thought it was taking too much space there and there was a lot of space to put it here in the living room so I brought it here put some of her books in there I got this shelf thing from Ikea and these boxes I got from Ikea also Um these cushions i got from home sense over the christmas it was a set of two so these two i got this joy it was actually two of them it was peace and joy the peace one is a like a, a red kind of red velvet kind of thing 
uh, so I moved that away and I kept the white one here because you know white matches with everything so yeah that's that's it for the living room I've already shown you the uh, the little balcony garden thing uh, in the previous video I'm still waiting for the the swing hanger to come so I can hang the swing so I've left the swing here I'm hoping that by the time the hanger comes it will be a better weather and we'll be able to enjoy the balcony those are Bell's bicycle and stuff over there and then moving on we go to the kitchen you have seen this kitchen several times but let me show you what I have here this microwave wasn't my choice uh, of microwave to go for but I had to buy it because we needed something quickly I got that from uh, Lidl but when you enter the living room right to just to your right I you remember that uh, shoe rack that I have in my room they were a pack of two if um, you saw something that I missed or forgot to mention, by all means, leave me a comment below and ask me and, I'm, and I'll include the, the link to it or tell you where I bought it from. Okay, so moving on. I just wanted to show you these light shades. Look at them. I love, I love the way it makes the lights uh, look on the ceiling. I got these these two big ones from ebay and the small one in the back from amazon if you haven't already guessed it i got this clock from clock and canvas and of course my security camera there are three of them here two of them are hidden i think are hidden and this visible one in the in the living room that it can see through to bell's uh, room the door bell's door and then the rest sees the, the other side of the room um over the christmas i think i showed you where i got this i got the piano from gear for music this entertainment unit is from ebay yeah it's from ebay and on here i keep this bowl here with some essential oils that I put in our humidifiers. I have this Google speaker thing I, um, I got for Christmas from a friend of mine and this speaker, silver press speaker and I got this really lovely unicorn thing. All the presents I got for Christmas are so lovely, it's unbelievable. Yeah, so that's it, that's my house. This is our flat, um, there isn't much here but I, I love it this way, you know why? Because it's much cleaner, it's much simpler to um, maintain and all that. Right, so guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. It has been an amazing day. If you saw something in the video that I did, I forgot to mention, by all means bring it to my attention and I'll show you or tell you where I bought it from. Other than that, yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. it it's not much, but I prefer to keep things clean and tidy. I'm hoping to get a few uh, picture frames, inspirational frames to go on the walls and maybe next time I'll show you where or how what I did with the walls. You never know. Uh, thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye!